Cool. I, I didn't do it. <laughs> I didn't do it. It wasn't me. It was him. He won the tournament. He sabotaged it. All right. I did it. You see, he even took the... All right. So, Sinji, congratulations on today's win. Thank you. Very nicely done with Pac-Man once again. Um, so, how do you feel about Palutena? Um, so, Wednesday, this past Wednesday, I got blown up by Jen. And I I know that there's a bunch of Palus, so I was like, all right, I have to do some research on this. I cannot, I cannot let this be, like, the new Cloud. You know, like, Smash 4 is, like, Cloud right, right. and Bayo and all that. I can't. I have to have it on an even playing field. So, I did a lot of research. Um, I watched a lot of Palutena matches. I watched my matches with Palutena. I grinded with other Palutena mains, and I got a lot of good ideas, uh, good advice, and stuff like that. So, um, coming in, I was like really comfortable. I really wanted to fight Ling Ling, but Ling Ling got destroyed by Odyssey. So. <laughs> Damn! What well, you got to do more like that? <laughs> yeah, I wanted to fight Ling Ling because. Uh, I wanted to play that matchup again because I felt like when I fought Samsora, I choked. I, I, I it, the crowd was just crazy. Like even when when people cheer for me or against me, I just get nervous. So like I choked versus Samsora, and I w I really wanted to play Ling Ling again. But one day we'll play again. You always um, have that opportunity, man. You know how New England and Trice are constantly going back and forth with each other. When we have our tournaments big, we got them big. Yeah. Um. But you brought up a really good idea of the like study the character, study your losses, study what you can change. Uh, how do you feel? What kind of changes did you implement into your play today? And how do you feel they impacted it? Uh, Besides you winning, I implemented a lot more Galaxian because I realized she likes to short hop a lot. So when she short hops, the loop from the Galaxian will hit her, and then you, uh, you know, you pretty much combo her afterwards. So. I had to take it really slow. Um, if I try to get too antsy, she gets advantage. She grabs me, puts me in the air. It's a 50-50 explosive flame up air. Like, she has a, a bunch of mix-ups. So I had to take it really slow against Palutena. Now, you say how you had to take it slow against a particular character. However, it seemed like a lot of your play was a lot more faster paced. Do you feel like that was just you feeling more comfortable when you were getting your game going? Or is that just you getting used to ultimate? Uh, it's both me getting used to ultimate. Also, when I beat Odyssey, I had a clearer mindset on what to do versus Jen in Grand Finals. So it really worked out afterwards. All right. Um, now, one thing we've seen is a lot of players are rocking Palutena and another character. Um, do you see the meta going in a spot where you're going to have to worry about, like, a select few characters and then just the other 75 or some odd? Uh, there's, like... For me, there's like eight matchups that I really want to grind out. I'm, I'm going to grind out some uh, in the venue, actually. Uh, one of them... One of them is... Uh, well, the biggest one was Wolf. When I played Wolf, against... Wolf, okay. Yeah, Dark Blues. Uh, I really want to get rid ready for that matchup because I saw a Japanese tournament where Zack Rai just yep. destroyed T. So, like, I'm just... I'm just wondering, like, I had a different approach fighting uh, Dark Blues and T did, but um, I wanted to see how uh, that matchup goes because it, it feels it feels like a stalemate. Like, it actually feels like a stalemate. Another matchup I wanted to work on was Zelda. Cause I'm Zelda, a little, really? I'm a little curious. Uh, I'm, I'm very curious on, like, the whole cast. So okay, that's you know, fair enough. You never know. Like, for example, Pac-Man beat Diddy Kong in Smash 4, and Diddy Kong was a terror in Smash 4. So like, I feel like that's an understatement, but yes. Yeah, but like ma matchups are like, you know, very important. Um, I want to master every matchup. Right now, I have a secondary Young Link, but I don't know. Young Link. Yeah, I, I love Young Link. Uh, he's better than he was from Melee because Melee, his hitboxes didn't work. It was just a bunch of stuff like it just didn't work. But now, everything works. It's kind of like Pac-Man, like his aerials work. His grab works, you know, they, they fixed a lot of things, so. All right, well, that actually goes really well into the next question I had planned for you was, um, you've always rocked Pac-Man, and you've dabbled in other characters in the past, but I was going to ask if there are any other secondaries that you'd want to supplement Pac-Man with, and what do you think Young Link brings to the table? Uh, Young Link, he's kind of like Pac-Man, where it's like, I, I also like Z-dropping, so, for right. example, you can take out a bomb, you can short hop, Z-drop, have a bomb in front of you, so the opponent can't really approach you freely. Um, 
I like his uh, overall speedy nature. Like he, he has that speed that Pac-Man doesn't have, but on top of that, he's still a projectile master. So he, he has um, similar traits. All right. Well, uh, it is getting a bit late into the evening. Um, thank you for clearing up grand finals in such convincing fashion for that. Um, but figuring to sign us off now. Uh, got any last words for the audience as we close out tonight? Um, shout out to my team, Deadly Alliance. Uh, everyone that's been supporting me. Um, shout out to everyone that's been supporting me since day one, since like, like 3DS, Smash 4, like since since then. Um, shout outs to everyone that came by today. Um, uh, shout outs to Light Going Roy. <laughs> uh, I like it. <laughs> Uh, shout out to the Pack Nation, everyone, my subs, everyone that follows me on Twitter, everyone that's very supportive. Uh, shout out to everyone that still has faith in this character because it's kind of mixed reviews, but uh, I think he's high tier in this game. Solid high tier, nowhere lower, nowhere upper. All right, that's, uh, that's pretty convincing in that. Now, where can we find you on social media besides Twitter that's right here in front of us? You mentioned you got subs. You streaming? Uh, yes, uh, I'm going to start streaming again. I actually have a voice actor helping me out with, like, alerts and stuff Ooh, like that. Ooh, okay. Yeah, so I'm going big with it. Um, you can follow me on Sinji93 and my YouTube, which I use mostly because I've, I've been doing guides. All right. Um, I did a Pac-Man guide. I think it has, like, 10,000 views right now it's crazy look at that man i mean you're this you're the pac-man to follow look what you're able to do today and that's right in tri-state a region that's being regarded as one of the most difficult to fight in right now yeah. and you're able to stand with the best of them in smash wars looking like you're going to be able to do the same for ultimate yeah uh my my youtube is Sinji smash okay. so you won't miss it so all right so that's going to be it for us tonight this is hangman i've been holding it down for you on the mic all day for today but it's always a pleasure with house of 3000 so make sure to drop a follow for house across all social media. If you're here on Twitch, drop the follow. If you got that Twitch Prime, drop the sub. But that is going to be it for us tonight. So have a good one. Have a good night.